Jeff Branson attempts to lay down a bunt. Watch Charlie Williams. He's going to call Willie Green out at third base. Ray Knight says, how do you call him out? And he says, Ray, you're out of here. Eventually against the Astros. Top 7-2-1 Reds. Bill Spires, chopper to first. And Spires hustling all the way. Beats Dave Berba to the bag. Berba doesn't agree. And Ray Knight, well, he has some issues. Justy Moat, let go of that anger. Don't keep it in. Not only on that play, for the season by John Sherholz. McGriff with the bases loaded. All three called by Wally Bell. Checks the Reds' dugout. Ray Knight trying again. Trying, trying. Just please toss me out. Here he comes, and woo! -hoo! Ray's the winner. Knight says that ball was right here. Kicks the plate, says next time it goes over there, call it a strike. Puts the hat down and leaves the field. So Ray Knight gets tossed. With that inspire is Red. He's trying to get him fired up. 3-2 on. Goodwin lines up the middle. Kent Merker was on. He's in. Steve Finley, though, goes to third. There's Dion. Puff the smoke. When the smoke clears, he's called out. Jerry Lane made the call. He is right on top of this call. Looks like he gets him before the bag. The dirt makes it look like he's safe, but actually the umpire with the right call. So there's Ray Knight talking to Lane. Picks up the bag. Jerry says, Ray, your history, if that thing dare touches the ground. Second ejection this month for night. Top seven, four, two pods. Cincinnati, here, new grass, new dirt, there. And out here, Jay Payton, Clark, and Pokey. No! Throws a little high for Pokey Reese. Could make that play. What's this? Barry Larkin and Pokey Reese make errors on back-to-back -back plays? Bob Quinn said, I cannot watch this. <laughs> and out he goes. Gets taught, taking a look at the throw up there. He didn't tell when it's a homer off the bat. <laughs> that one didn't look like one. Bases are loaded in the fifth. Kane Davis steps off. Bob Boone, the manager, wants a balk call. Hunter Wendelstedt says, and away you go. The story of this one in the sixth inning. Here's the double play that wasn't. Aaron Boone taps third, the throw to first. They say that Sean Casey took his foot off the bag. He didn't. Bob Boone argues that, but Jerry Lane tosses him. Lane tosses Boone, and uh, to the showers he went. Four. Top four, two outs for Sean Casey, full count. And Casey rung up by C.B. Buckner behind home plate. Casey doesn't think so. Dave Miley really doesn't think so. He comes out there to argue. Casey said afterward, that was one of the weirdest, coolest, craziest games that I've ever been a part of, and Miley won't be around to see the end. Claude first. He's gone. And a pop-up driven down the right field line. Charlie Moore has some room, and he makes the catch and then drops the ball. No catch, no catch. Larry Barnett waves away the catch, and he'll get a protest from Charlie Moore. No. Well, that's going to wind up. A and he's out of there. Harvey King has been thrown out by Larry Barnett. Oh, that'll get the crowd going. Harvey saying, well, if you think I said something now, Listen to this. <laughs> He's going to get his money's worth now. Apparently, we don't have a replay on that ball. Well, let's... Keene and Barnett are going at it. Keene has been given the heave hole here. And this is the third time we've seen an opposing manager heave in the last week. Well, Joe couldn't believe it. Brewers down 8-3. John Johnstone, Marquise Grissom. Bob Davidson says strike three. Grissom's not happy. Davidson hurts something he wasn't too thrilled with. He sends Grissom to the showers early. Look at the interim manager, Jim Lefevre, getting pushed back by Marquise Grissom. And then Jim Lefevre turned and said, I'm not going to hold Grissom off. I may as well just go with the ump because Grissom's a little too strong. And then Lefevre got the old heave home. In the third, two batters later, Will Kinane facing Jones. That's a little inside. Oh, boy, twice. Bill Wilkie comes out and says, let's try to be more sporting. Lopes comes out, doesn't like it, says the wrong word, gets tossed. Perhaps they tossed. Richie Sexton, bottom four scoreless game. Sexton, uh-oh, called out on strikes. And he's a big man. You don't want to get him angry. But Doug Eddings throws him out. That's a ball. Yeah, for a guy 6'7", the pitch looks a little low. And then uh, Jerry Royster will get ejected for arguing the call and sticking up for Richie. Well, Larry Vanover, first base umpire, says he didn't touch him, but Really can't tell there. And now the call is going to be out. <laughs> well, that's very interesting. Yeah. Now here comes Ken Maka. And he is hot under the collar right now. Now he's out. He has been ejected from the ball game.
10 to 3 Cubs. As Soriano is brushed and now Latroy Hawkins has been thrown out. So Tom Hallion ejects Latroy Hawkins and Ken Mock is going to get his say here. Now this is everything that's wrong with you know the way they handle this you know. Now by the letter of the rule you have to be able to touch the base. Council made no attempt at the base. Yeah, and, and that's the thing that's why it was called because he did not at least make an effort to grab for second base. Haven't seen Maka this animated all season and there he goes. Lead run at second and Nady hits one hard base hit. Safe at second. second. Is Torres who got on because of the error comes around to score and Soriano with the RBI hit. It's three to two. Yep. I mean, as Torres knows, he's got to get a good jump out there at second base. That ball was hit hard right at Jason Bay in left field. He's either going to score or he's going to get doubled off second base. Fortunately, the ball hit grass first and he scored easily. Jim nice Tracy to... arguing with Tom Halley in the first base umpire because he was the umpire that made the call at second. And now Tracy's been tossed. 1992, it's been all downhill, and Green greets Armas with a liner to left. Bay does not make the catch. It's a trap, but they'll get a force at second as easily did not read it. He was going back to first base. The third base umpire, Larry Vanover, signaled safe. And by the way, during my days of playing, you never saw umpires come together and have a congregation like that. Well, oh. Tracy's been ejected. As soon as he threw the cap down, that was going to be the end of it. And, and you can understand his frustration because it was the wrong call. And even if the umpires saw that it was a catch, you know, you can't penalize the Met base runner because the umpire made a bad call. He, he 